Hello there, Don Rick 13 here again. Welcome to another beer review. Hey, Shock Top. Belgian White. <sighs> Belgian style wheat ale brewed with citrus peels and coriander. It's definitely serious. The guy has a mohawk. Very. 5.2% alcohol by volume. Uh, Belgian style wheat ale brewed with citrus peels and coriander. I don't think I already read that, but. <laughs> Poured down side of glass. Well, kind of my mason jar. Kill half inches left in the bottle, swirl and pour remaining brew to properly blend spices and release the aroma. Give that a roll. Pretty original label. Gotta yeah. give it that. I'm down with it. Had this in Newfoundland, it was freaking awesome on tap, but. Interesting how this goes. I think it's made by Budweiser, I believe. If I remember correctly. Yeah. So it's a pour <coughs> inside of the glass like this? Yep, yeah. over the side. <laughs> <laughs> Should actually have done that. This isn't working out well. The attractions weren't clear enough. <laughs> Any illustrations? <laughs> Yep, flotation is. Flotation is. Lucky. That's probably the orange peel and the lemon peel. <laughs> oh, there we are. Coriander. Oh, yeah. Is it ever? There's your wheat and orange. Yeah. Orange yeah. Sure. Orange. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's not really getting any wheat. I, I get the spices. Yeah, these are <coughs> spicy. You're oh, right. Yeah. Smells good, except for mm -hmm. the coriander. I'm kind of starting to have a big problem with coriander, but that's just me. Want to jump in? Yeah. <laughs> jump. jump in. There we go. Cheers. Cheers. Mm. That's good, yeah. A lot of coriander in there. Yeah. It's killing oh. it. What the hell? What? It's orange Skittles or something. <laughs> oh, very candy like. Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah. Yeah, I'm getting that too. A little, uh, like uh, almost the uh, orange gummy bears, like the fake kind of orangey taste. You know, you get up in the morning real early, you can have that for breakfast. Yeah, that is, would be a breakfast beer. That's a breakfast beer. A lot of wheat beers are good for breakfast. Nothing's I never had a beer for breakfast. I'll say it, I did. <laughs> <laughs> a couple times. <laughs> Starts the day pretty good, eh? <laughs> well, when you're at the camp, <laughs> anything's go. Ciders that can be good job like that, too. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Like your summer's back. <laughs> I'm getting a fairly, I'm getting a little earthiness off of it as well. Mm -hmm. yeah. and pretty, pretty murky, and I got the but I did get the bottom. bottom, but that's okay. Yep. Spices linger wrong after, uh, and it's the aftertaste. Mm, yeah. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. It, was a, it was a little bit peppery, that might be nice too, but mm -hmm. there's other spicy other ways. I don't know. Oh. I wouldn't drink at 24. <laughs> no. Yeah, no, that'd be sir. rough. <laughs> but I would definitely start out the day with maybe four of them. Yeah. Really cold. To do a gauntlet. In a chilled mug. Yeah. Chill mug. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Gauntlet Very chill. Challenge. Yeah. Shock top. That would get the stuff going Six. real quick. Shock top sixer. Six of them. Yeah. yeah. That's only basically a cup of beer. So. <laughs> anyway, for rating, I go. I'd probably drink it again. Yeah. No, I would. I mean, yeah, I'd be happy. For breakfast. Yeah. For <laughs> nice ice cold and right in the cooler out right of the fridge. Yeah. Yeah. I'd probably be alright. I yeah. go uh I go three on this one. Yeah. It's a bit too sweet for me. I'll go two point five. Yeah. yeah. Same here for me. I don't know if I I like it, but I wouldn't drink that that much. But yeah. Two point five. Right on. Yep. It's cold. Yeah, there's another one. We'll see you in a bit for uh if we can get uh, Jason out of the kitchen. <laughs> we'll see what happens. All right. Cheers. Cheers. Cheers.